Race three is the first of today's two two-year-old races. This is a ten furlong event for the two-year-olds. So quite a long way for them to go. Fidel at the top for Alex Cherry. Shamik Maker for CDJ Liggett. Then Long Live the Queen, David Hooley. Oceans of Aegis for Darren Thompson. Power and Ambition, Leon Van Rensburg. Rochester Steam, Vinnie Gerard. Clipthorn Rose Gen for CDJ Liggett. Non-applause for Craig Allen. Has also got Zaf Zala. Ballerina Queen and Roaring Forces for Martin Leedham. State funded for Graham Clitterbuck and Fremont Chartridge for Vinnie Gerard, so 13 this time then, all quietly installed and ready to go, or in 40's closest to us as they break away, and Power and Ambition was one of the first ones out, the only grey in the field, Ballerina Queen also got out quickly, and he's possibly just in front, from non applause, Oceans of Aegis is also close up there as well, We're looking towards the back, Clipthorn Rose Gen, just about the back marker, but they're already through the first couple of furlongs in, and Shamik Maker, and non applause are now the leaders with Ballerina Queen got the rail just behind them. Oceans of Aegis is in third and then in and fourth, sorry, then comes Roaring Forties, the second of the two in the purple and white stripes right over on the near side on the rail. Long live the Queen is the one in the old purple. Then Rochester Steam is after that one with Power and Ambition, Zafzala, and then Fidel and looking to the back state funded and Fremont Chartridge of the back pair. But it's not applause. It was two lengths clear then of the grey ballerina queen on the inside of Shamik Maker in third, then tucked in behind them Oceans of Aegis and then Roaring Forties is after that one, Rochester Steam and Long Live the Queen still going well, then Zaf Zala and Fidel, Power and Ambition has lost its place and dropped right out the back, so too state funding from Fremont Chartridge is still just about the back marker, and they're coming down towards the final five furlongs in now and non applause is the leader by about two lengths to Shamik Maker who's now gone second, Oceans of Aegis has moved through into third, Ballerina Queen still Kicking on there in fourth on the rail. Then closest to us is Rochester Steam trying to get going. Also coming through there, Roaring Forties now coming through with a run. Long live the Queen. Rochester Steam after that. Zaf Zala is next, but it's still none applause who's in the lead. And two lengths clear from Oceans of Aegis in second. Roaring Forties is now coming with a good one on the outside. Ballerina Queen on the rail. Burst in between them. Clip form. Rose Jen has come from absolutely nowhere. So too long live the Queen coming on there as well, but it's not applause who might have slipped the field as they come down towards the final two furlongs. It's not applause by two and a half lengths to Clipthorn Rose Gen in second Ballerina Queen sticking on in third then Zaf Zala is now coming with a run on the outside also finishing well his power and ambition but it's still not applause in front not applause in the leader but now we're getting to top here comes Clipthorn Rose Gen there one inside the final third and not applause is being challenged now by Clipthorn Rose Gen Clipthorn Rose Gen is taking it up from power and ambition it's Clipthorn Rose Gen power and ambition Oceans of Ages finishing well they flash past the post and power and ambition I think has just got up to take it Pretty close. Uh, like Clipthorn Rose Gen was going to take over that jockey. Just seemed to stop riding on that one in the shadow of the post. And the big gun's going to swamp CDJ Liggett, but I'm sure he'll be delighted with that one because that looked all over the winner coming into the final few yards but power ambitions the winner for leon van rinsburg oceans of ages for darren thompson second clip thorn rose gen for cdj liggett was third ballerina queen for martin was fourth and state funded for graham clutterbuck was fifth